So what would happen tomorrow if a new pandemic strain emerged is that people would try to identify the sequence of that virus as quickly as possible. We're very good at doing that. We can do that now within days, if not within hours. The problem is what you do next. And the problem is, in a way, technical. There are a whole variety of ways you can make a vaccine. There isn't a structure for getting all the people who make vaccines in different ways to try all those ways at the same time. So there's delay. Individual companies tend to work on their own to try and produce something rather than in collaboration with lots of other companies. The clinical testing could be much faster. We still have to go through regulatory processes that are designed for new vaccines where there's a generous timeline. With a pandemic, days matter. So that needs to be accelerated. And then the manufacturing of vaccines, you're looking at manufacturing hundreds of millions of doses of a pandemic flu vaccine very quickly. There is not a manufacturing facility standing by ready to go. We just don't have that system in place. So there has been a great deal of discussion about these issues, but nobody's actually put in the huge amount of money that would be required to have this infrastructure ready and standing by if a pathogen emerged. So it is a worry.